GoPros have long been the gold standard of action cameras. The company was crucial in popularizing portable, rugged cameras for recording up close and personal sports and action videos and currently produces a range of models to suit different budgets. GoPro is a pioneer in the action camera industry. There are plenty of excellent bargains right now. Though you will find hundreds or even thousands of them in the market, here are the top 5 best GoPro alternatives, you will know why they are best after you watch the whole video about them. So let's get started. And don't forget to check the product link in the description. Number 1. DJI Osmo Action. The DJI Osmo Action is DJI's first action camera, and it's a solid, more affordable alternative to the GoPro Hero 9 Black. It's one of the first action cams to feature a handy front-facing live-view screen for selfies and vlogs. It also has an excellent electronic stabilization feature to reduce camera shake unsurprising for a company known for its gimbals and drones. DJI also advertises that it's waterproof to a depth of 11M without a protective case and that it can withstand temperatures as low as 10C, so you can bring it wherever your adventures take you. The DJI Osmo Action is excellent for action videos. You can easily mount it onto a helmet or chest rig, and it's sturdy and waterproof to an advertised depth of 11M. It has a fantastic video stabilization feature to help smooth out the camera shake. It also has a lot of frame rate options, including 4K up to 60 frames per second and 1080p up to 240 frames per second, meaning you can capture various kinds of slow motion video. The DJI Osmo Action is good for vlogging. It's incredibly portable for low profile vlogging, and it has a front facing screen with live view, meaning you can see yourself while you record. On top of that, its video stabilization feature does a fantastic job smoothing out camera shake if you record while walking, though enabling it incurs a noticeable crop. The DJI Osmo is highly portable. Without its mounting frame, it's a tiny bit smaller and lighter than the GoPro Hero 10 Black and GoPro Hero 9 Black. You can easily slip it into a small bag or jacket pocket for easy transport. The DJI Osmo feels very solidly built. It's made mostly of hard plastic with a textured plastic grip around the body. The DJI Osmo has two screens. On the back is its primary touchscreen. The DJI Osmo Action has an excellent menu system. It's simple and easy to navigate using the touchscreen. Number 2. Akeso Brave 7 LE. The Akeso Brave 7 LE is a compact action camera that represents an alternative to models in the GoPro lineup. Like most action cams, its compact body is incredibly portable, and you can mount it on many action camera mounts, rigs, or helmets. It has dual screens, so you can monitor yourself on the front-facing screen when self-recording. It can shoot at up to 120 frames per second in FHD to capture fast action or generate slow-motion footage. The Akeso Brave 7 LE is adequate for action videos. It's incredibly portable and comes with many mounting accessories in the box. It also comes with a built-in tripod mount. It's rated to be waterproof up to 1M without its protective case and up to 131 feet with the case equipped. It has a decent image stabilization feature that does a good job of reducing camera shake. The Akeso Brave 7 LE is a poor choice for travel photography. While it's very portable to take with you wherever you travel, it can take photos, and the wide-angle lens creates a fisheye effect that can be distracting. It lacks an autofocus feature, so everything stays in focus. However, it gives you less flexibility to compose different shots. On the upside, it has great battery life and feels well-built, with a protective case that gives it added ruggedness and even greater waterproofing. This camera has an additional screen on the front that can be used for live view while recording and also displays information like shooting mode and remaining battery life. 
This camera only has a single burst mode that can be set to take bursts of 3, 7, 15, or 30 images, but it consistently shoots at a speed of 1 frame per second. The Akeso Brave 7 LE is okay for vlogging. It has a front-facing screen that lets you monitor the image as you record when shooting in a selfie position. Number 3. DJI Pocket 2. The DJI Pocket 2 is a handheld camera aimed at vloggers, replacing the DJI Osmo Pocket. Like its predecessor, it has a built-in 3-axis gimbal that offers exceptional image and video stabilization. It's also lightweight and portable, and it comes with a lot of frame rate options. It can record and playback video at up to 60 frames per second in 4K and FHD, and it has an added high-speed recording setting in FHD that can record 120 frames per second and 240 frames per second video for slow-motion playback. That said, its overall video quality is just okay, and it tends to get quite hot during use, especially when shooting in 4K. The DJI Pocket 2 is good for action videos. It has remarkable video stabilization performance thanks to its built-in gimbal, although it makes it harder to mount on a helmet or chest rig for first-person POV action video. It supports 4K video up to 60 frames per second and FHD video up to 240 frames per second, but it can only play back 120 frames per second and 240 frames per second video in slow motion. The DJI Pocket 2 is decent for travel photography. It's incredibly portable, making it easy to take on the go, and it has a very good battery life, though this can vary with real-world conditions. Its built-in gimbal also does an incredible job of smoothing out the camera shake. That said, its image quality is just okay, and it has a fixed focal length and aperture, giving you less flexibility to compose different shots. The DJI Pocket 2 is good for vlogging. It's incredibly portable and comes with a built-in 3-axis stabilized gimbal to reduce almost all camera shake when recording 4K or FHD video. You can use its screen for live view to monitor yourself and ensure you stay in the frame. And you can also connect your phone to use as a larger screen. Like the DJI Osmo Action, the build quality is excellent. Number 4. DJI Action 2. This is an action camera that looks and works like nothing before it. Having such a tiny main camera has previously come with usability sacrifices, yet here is a polished camera and powerful camera with a fluid OLED touchscreen that forms the center of a versatile system. Image stabilization and horizon leveling are all there too, and the app has all the elegance you'd expect of DJI. While the max resolution is a minor disappointment, this feels like a better ecosystem for the average GoPro customer, and the lack of subscription discounts is reassuring too. The camera brings a modular system so that the user can choose between size, weight, and power more easily than other action cameras that can be taken in and out of their water housings. The unique Action 2 design gives you the choice of a very compact 56-gram camera, which can record straight onto its built-in storage when you need to be compact. The entire back face is taken up by a punchy square 1.76-inch OLED touchscreen for control, the gorgeous grey aluminum rounded square is IPX8 waterproof to 10M when used alone. If you want performance closer to a big action camera, then you can attach a secondary unit. From launch, you need to choose which of these modules you're buying with the camera you can. The secondary touchscreen faces the lens side, making vlogging easier, while the alternative is a plain box-like action camera of old. Both bring a microSD card slot and USB-C connector, so you need one or the other to charge the primary camera and make physical cable downloads. Using DJI's MIMO app is a convenient solution for clumsy fingers. In manual mode, photography features like overexposure warnings are on offer, while selecting the mode is very natural to DJI drone users or, well, anyone who's used their phone's camera. There are some quirks to the system, not least when adjusting resolution. Number 5. XTUS 3 Pro. The action camera 4K video of the S3 record in native 4K 30fps Ultra HD resolution, you can film your adventures to view later, capturing footage to share with family and friends. 
The Action Cam comes with a rechargeable 1,350 mAh battery of up to 120 minutes. It supports an external power supply while charging and recording. The remote control watch and 19 accessories kits are available for most kinds of cameras even GoPro. The Action Camera has a front-facing screen that is perfect for vloggers, making it easier than ever to record yourself and produce incredible content for social media and YouTube. It also comes with a rear and front dual-screen display. The front screen allows you to easily frame up selfie shots a nice touch for vlogging or previewing your shot. The built-in electronic image stabilizer will make the video more stable and smooth even during the move. The S3 waterproof camera with image stabilization smooths out all the bumps in the road. And with features such as shock resistance and waterproofing, they can go places where no smartphone would survive. S3 Action Camera is waterproof up to 5 meters underwater without an external housing. Up to 40 meters waterproof with the included housing sealed. From cycling to surfing to skydiving, a rugged camera is ideal for capturing your adventurous pursuits. More than stable, high-resolution video, sports cameras also offers a range of smart features and shooting modes to help you capture and share cinematic shots. Frame rates of up to 30 frames per second mean the best rugged cams can deliver silky slow-motion footage, while time-lapse and hyperlapse modes allow you to capture the passage of time with dramatic effect. The underwater camera also includes Wi-Fi smartphone connectivity for easy editing, sharing, and streaming. The S3 Action Camera lets you record video in full 360 degrees, so you'll never miss a moment. You can then extract a flat crop from the footage or, for full immersion, watch your adventures back with a virtual reality headset.